Okay, so this is like the start of my next video. I look exactly the same as the end of my last one because like I'm, I just ended that one now I'm starting this one because it's a new day, a new drive. Um, but today I want to drive to like maybe Illinois so that I only have two more days of a drive to get to South Dakota. And like once I get to South Dakota, it'll start slowing down a lot more and I won't be in such a rush to like drive everywhere so fast and like so immediate. But like I just want to get out of this part of the country so I want to get like over into the western half of the country as soon as I can so like once I hit South Dakota like if you drew a line down the middle of the country I will officially be in like the west half of it which is exciting but yeah so today's drive I'm not exactly sure where I'm going yet I have to look at campgrounds um and then I'll see where I'm driving to but oh my gosh Andy and Kim, my mom's friends that I'm staying with, oh, so nice. I even got to shower, so that's fun. And they, oh, they even, like, I got here last night and they were like, oh my gosh, are you hungry? And I was like, sure. And then, like, this morning I'm walking out to go grab my shower stuff. Um, because, like, I have my own, so, like, why not just, like, grab it all? Convenient. And, like, as I'm walking back in, Andy's like, do you want breakfast? Are you hungry? And I'm like, oh. Well, can I shower first? And he's like, yeah, just come get me. I'm like, thanks, man. They're just so nice. It's not that I expected them to be mean, but it's just like, you don't want to have, like, expectations. You'd be like, when I get there, they better do this, this, and this. You know, so it's like, uh. But anyways, I'm going to keep getting ready because I don't want to take too long because they have, like, an electrician or something coming that has to come down to the basement. So it's like, I kind of want to rebreathe my hair and, like, go upstairs and then get my iPad so I can do some planning for today. <laughs> Um, and write down like my gas that I got yesterday and whatnot. So that's the plan for right now. All right, so I just got in my car. I'm all packed up and ready to go. They I just said goodbye to Andy and Kim. They were so nice when we stayed there. Um, but now I'm off to Indiana. It's a five and a half hour drive. So not too bad, a little shorter than yesterday's drive. But um, yeah, I'm excited. This will be my first night sleeping in my Jeep. Ah, I just think it's funny because the exit I have to get off right now is 0B. I have never heard of an exit 0 before. Like, what the heck? Look at that. 0B. Isn't that something? Anyways, I've only been driving for like half an hour, so I'm not very far, but like, I just, I just thought that was cute. <laughs> I got like 3 hours and 50 something minutes left. I'm at my first rest stop just to stretch a little bit after driving for like a long, like an hour and 40-ish minutes but um yeah it's much more populated than the last ones I had been to I'm currently in Ohio also by the way um I briefly went through West Virginia which I didn't realize I was supposed to do like I didn't know that was the way I was going but yeah so I went through West Virginia so let's see Started in Connecticut, went through New York, went through Pennsylvania, West Virginia, now I'm in Ohio, going to Indiana. So I covered like a like a fair amount of states. Um yeah. So that's <laughs> Thing. And I still can't find any stickers, but I did find magnets, so I guess I'm collecting state magnets after all. So now I can just like, but I mean, I guess it works out because then I can move them. So, like, if I ever, like, for some reason, like, for some reason, like, if I ever didn't have my Jeep, I can just take the magnets, like, put them on a fridge or something. I don't know. But I'll have the magnets from my road trip. So that's exciting. They didn't have a West Virginia one, um, but that's okay because they had like all the states so I just got the ones I've driven through so far and then every time I go to a new state I'll just like get the new one because like I was disappointed I couldn't get one from Pennsylvania or like West Virginia or anything but I went all out I even got Connecticut and New York but it was part of my road trip so I mean you know so I will show those when I get to the campground I'm like an hour and a half away it's just straight and farms it's boring so I had to stop stretch my legs and check another uh, gas station for magnets but uh, hopefully next time 
I should be at the campground. If they let me in, because I didn't make a reservation. I, it's, it said first come, first serve, so hopefully I can do that. Anyways, I will see you at the campground then. This is literally all I'm driving through. There's just farms like this for just miles. <laughs> but at least there's... So, I got my campground stuff. I am able to stay the night. Jeep just waved at me. Not really bluster for a moment. Hanging that up. This campground literally looks fake. I can't wait to like insert videos of like what this campground looks like. It's like too perfect. It's like kind of creeping me out. It's <laughs> and it also happens. This There's like. Wait till I show you guys like the little lake that's like right on the campground and this is like off the highway So on the highway when I drove by I saw it had to get off the highway loop around and come over, but uh, I can't wait to just like show some videos of this place <laughs> Also, I can't show you, I'll flip the camera after. We're not at the campground. Um, I have my little campground map, like I talked about before. But let me show you one of the rules. Let me show you one of the rules. I'm definitely not at home anymore, that's for sure. So as you can see, it's like, you know, average rules, right? Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. What? I have never seen a pool have an actual rule that says you can't wear a bikini. What? Also, the land here is so flat. Like, so flat. Like, after um, I situate a little bit, I'm gonna walk around and, like, record, like, what the campground looks like. It's, like, really pretty. Like, perfect. Like, everything just looks how it should look. Um, I feel a little awkward because I'm wearing like regular shorts, um, but every girl I've seen is wearing skirts past their knees. <laughs> and I'm not judging anyone. It's just not what I'm used to seeing. And they were singing Christian music, power to them. But like, I was not expecting this, that's for sure. Also, I got the collection going all the states. I'm missing West Virginia um, right here, but those are the states I've gone to aside from West Virginia. That's on the list. But yeah, after I walk around the campground, I will probably cook and just do stuff like that. But after today, I'll be driving maybe to Iowa and then I cross the time zone tomorrow. Once I get through Indiana and into Illinois, I will be in central time zone. Uh, so that's exciting, but I'll probably make pasta tonight. I'm being honest with you. Um, but yeah. So this is my camp around. It's like my little campsite right here. Just across from where I am is this little bridge that comes over this water. A little creek moment. This is cute. And then like right next to it, there's a whole playground. I have never seen such a large playscape. So that's cute. That's the pool that you're not allowed to wear a bikini in. Um, like, oh my gosh. There's this one side. I kind of want to go down it, but I don't know if I'm like too old or if they're going to be like, um, what are you doing? You know, I'm already pushing my luck with the shorts I'm wearing. 
<laughs> but this is the slide I was just talking about. I have never seen such a big like playground slide before. And then they have mini golf next to the basketball court. So this is cute. That's what that looks like. It is a religious campground, you can't tell. That's the slide from the side angle. And they have some volleyball and another gazebo. And then there's this like, I think it's man-made. I wouldn't doubt it if it was man-made, but there's this little pond, lake, whatever you want to call it. There's docks on every side, but it's just so pretty. Like the way the grass just like comes all the way up around it. It's not like all gross and sandy and whatnot, but you can come out to the end of the dock. This is what it looks like. Everything's just so flat. That's the highway I took to get here. But look, there's like nothing, just flatness. That's the corn. But yeah, so that's the campground. Um, there's also like a little public fire pit area. Um, I'll show you that though real quick. So I got distracted, but I don't see any sign with an age limit. So I mean like, I think I'm gonna go in it. This thing is so small, I cannot believe it will literally crawl in this right now. The entrance is like right there, but I'm about to like, <laughs> I had to do it. I couldn't just look at the slide and not go in. This is like tedious, my bad knees hate me. Like, look how tiny this is. <laughs> There's like holes everywhere too. Oh, it's so hot outside. It's like 86 degrees. I can almost stand up where it's like at an angle. But like, oh, you can get like in here. You keep trying out right now. Go to spiral up oh, the slide. Or not the slide, but uh, well, there was a button. Like, you come up. And go up somewhere. And everywhere. It's a little clear thing. I swear if a child comes in here, I will be so embarrassed. Oh. I have options now. I don't know which way I should go. I think the slide is this way. That's like that blue at the end of this. That's like the smaller top slide going down. Ugh. Let me sit down for a second. Whew. So we have this way, this way, and this way. I'm out of breath. The crawling you have to do. Look, I'm so hot. Ew. Look how high I am. <laughs> this was like exhausting. Appreciate this little view though of the campground. That's why you need a skirt. Your legs aren't gonna fit down it. You're gonna be like sticky. I gotta like sit all the way on my butt. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, that was mortifying. I should take my slides off for the second half. Hold on. That was pretty good down there, but one second. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. That was fast. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is fun. Oh my god. That was incredible. Totally worth it. Had I worn leggings, it would have been a game changer. I'm gonna 
thought they were yelling at me. I was like, I'm not too old, I swear. Anyways, back to the tour. <laughs> okay, so there's more flatness, but then there's also another little bridge. The other one I was at over before was right there. So, same idea, look how clear it is as before. And then you have the public fire pit over here. So that's what that looks like. In relation to where I am, you can see my Jeep right there. But it's the public fire pit. There's like this little walkway with the flowers. A little white fence. And this little brick walkway leads over to their second gazebo. This one's smaller. It's like a few weeks ago, there was a tornado like 30 minutes from where I'm staying right now. Tell me why I didn't realize Indi Indiana didn't <laughs> have tornadoes. <laughs> like, it's super flat. I don't know why I didn't like realize this, but I'm like, huh, there's a thunderstorm rolling in tonight. And I'm like, imagine a tornado just like came by. Like, I'd pee my pants. I mean, it'd be a really cool video, though, you know? Love to see it. I'd hate to live through it, though, you know, if it, like, came over here. But, like, that's fine. I'm sure I'd be fine. You can see the thunderstorm rolling around. Oh, my God, I forgot the umbrella. I'm going to boil my pasta before it starts pouring. I also have to close my windows. Because that would be unfortunate. I hope I have time. I was editing yesterday's video. I don't know why I couldn't do that while it rained inside my Jeep, but... Okay, so I actually changed my mind. We're not going to make pasta because the storm looks like it's really rolling its way in. And the last thing I want is to casually get stuck in the rain. So we're just going to save that for another time. We're going to have peanut butter and jelly instead. I'm sprinkle and I can literally see the rain behind me getting thicker. No, I'm gonna run. Oh, no, it's pouring. I switched the bathroom, but like, dude, it just started pouring. Oh, man. I don't know what happened. There you go. Okay, it is now like I'm getting ready for bed, and when I say getting ready, I mean like, I'm gonna go to sleep once I, um, end this. But we got the, the fancy sleeping lights on, the fan is on, all of the blinds are closed. I'm so, I'm so comfortable. Literally love my bed. Um, so yeah, tomorrow I'll wake up plan where I'm driving to and I guess we'll have to figure it out but that's I guess this will be the end of the video um so uh thanks for watching guys I will see you tomorrow in the next video <laughs>